Hey, how's it going? Marty Schwartz here. Uh, I've got a little chord progression, a little chord sequence that um, happens to be the most popular chord progression in uh, pretty much all jazz standards. Um, and anyway, you can always check out You Can Learn Guitar on YouTube or GuitarJams.com, the site, talk more about this kind of stuff. But basically, here are the chords. Here's, here's what they are. It's a D minor 7 chord. And I'm used to, when I do any kind of finger stuff, I'm used to tucking my pick in there, but most people aren't used to that. So basically what I'm doing is I'm using my thumb on the A string right there. And then, and then I'm using my uh, each consecutive finger here. You can do it this way. You'd have your thumb, thumb on that one, first finger on that one, middle finger, ring finger, like that. And with that D minor 7 chord, you just go, you just kind of pluck them with your fingers. Okay, and then on the, and then the next chord is G7. And what I'm going to do with my right hand with this G7 is I'm going to have my thumb on that, and then I'm going to skip the A string, and then consecutive fingers on that. Just like that. So the D minor 7. To the G7. Thumbs up here. These fingers are still basically in the same spot, huh? Okay. Then we're going to move uh, on the right hand, just the thumb's going to go back to the A string, and then we're going to play what's called C, roots right there, major 7. So here's what we have so far D minor 7 to G7 to C major 7. Then I'm going to show you a really cool voicing. This is um, major seven. It's F major seven. The roots on the D string. So third fret on the D string, and then my ring finger just covers that, and then these three across. So check it out. So these, I'm just going thumb and then consecutive again, like that. So we have and this all fits into the key of C major and it would be called a two, five, one, four. And, um, yeah, you don't have to worry about that. But so, anyway, since the whole thing fits into a key, you could actually play the C major scale over that to improvise, or you could play the, um, basically the C major pentatonic, which shares all the same notes as the A minor pentatonic. 